Anna Camden with the top of the key. Chest pass to her roommate, Marisa. Drives inside. Extra pass, Sable. Right block gets in. Welcome to State College, Tova Sable. And that was one of the best offensive sequences for Coppin State. And here comes McKenna Marisa, zigzagging her way through a triple team. No look to her roommate, Camden. Finger roll. Delicate touch, and it's in. A little too strong off the back iron. Cleared by Kelly Jaycott. Jaycott zips a pass to Camden, thought about the three, reshuffles her feet, extra pass to Jaycott, give and go action, and it works. It's the three Pennsylvania State Players of the Year on this roster. What a stat. Cash, off the glass, counts in the foul. Janasia Cash does the little and one with her right fingertip. Hashtag it, cash is money. I want to see that all over the place tonight and into tomorrow, celebrating Thanksgiving with the fam. Cash is money. They trail by five. Thomas with the ball near wing. Starts, stops, now starts again, accelerates, kick out. Marisa, rhythmic three. That's good on the far side for McKenna Marisa as the lead swells to eight for the Lady Lions, largest lead. Right in the shooter's pocket. I mean, that was like the perfect place to hit Marisa. Right near her right hip. Pause double team by Sable and Cash, and the ball is nearly picked off by Thomas. Sable's able to save it. Over to Thomas, darts one over to Hagen's Far side layup, good on the left block. Shovels it over to CC Thomas, who's playing her best game as a Lady Lion. Crossover dribble into traffic, able to pass from the seat of her pants to Janasia Cash on the right block. Great job by Janasia Cash, almost reaching over Benzel to grab that ball away and get the layup to go. Thomas was sitting. In stride, rhythmic three, Vargas, shot is short, Camden taps it to Marisa. Baseball pass up the near side, 30-footer, CC Thomas, tough angle, still able to guide it in. Thornton, right wing, all alone three, good release, too strong, offensive rebound, tracked down by Marisa. Bounce pass to Cash, gets it on the right block. What a good find for McKenna Marisa. 5.52 to go on the fourth, and Tammy Reese needs a timeout. 59, 56. Well, Purdue's doing a really good job of settling down and dictating the pace, and Penn State's playing off a little too much offensively. So as you see, Anna Camden getting the bucket there for Penn State. They're going to pick up full court here. Too strong. Kyle at 6'6", six, six, turns it over. On the leak out, Marisa. McKenna Marisa. At Penn State for sure in her second season. Slow start for both of these offenses here. They go down low to Cash. I feel like she took advantage initially of the extra time she was going to get with the Reese injury, but she certainly has in the last couple of games. Well, I think it's evident. I mean, if you're any kind of competitor, you kind of see the writing on the wall. Marisa gets stopped. And the short pass there for Burke for her first points. And she knocks down her first three-point shot of the night. Very unselfish play from Ohio State there. Running, and that's the pace that Penn State wants is Jaycock on the receiving end. Camden's able to get over and make the block, and she's actually had a couple of uh, multiple block games already this year. Little high-low action sneaking behind the defense. It's Kelly Jaycock. Beverly was open in the far corner, but they hand it off to her at the right wing. Beverly moves to the top. They whip it deep down low to Cash. Blow by a couple, past a couple defenders. Splits a double team and banks it in. And a nice job by Penn State keeping that one in. Jaycott racing back to keep it from going out of bounds. In the corner is good. Maddie Burke connects. And there's a little, another look, excuse me, at the Maddie Burke. Beverly, here's Jaycott on Powell. And Cash is wide open in the paint. She goes up again. Cash now has 14 points. Hartman. Jogs up the near side. That pass deflected by Marisa and stolen away. Two on one numbers here for Penn State. Beverly shovels it to Marisa. Left block laying off the glass. Good. Double double is coming against Minnesota, as we had mentioned in the last meeting, and against Indiana and Syracuse this year. And Cash coming down with another rebound. How about the outlet pass? Penn State wants to pass and run. And it's Beverly with the end one. In transition, watch this pass up the floor by Cash. The pass is perfectly placed. Yeah, but when yeah. chaos happens awesome. like that, it is memorable. Here's Penn State in the final few seconds. And the bucket is good for Burke. Okay, that's what we have on the clock, 6.3.
Let's just get to the rack. All the way to the rim, a nice drop off pass. Nicely executed in transition. Penn State has won eight of the last nine against Illinois. Good movement away from the basketball by McKenna Marisa to get herself an easy bucket. Terry, three. Rebound on the other side by Burke. Yeah, she still seems to be grimacing. Ahead of the defense, Hannah Camden. Rebound Marisa, very good rebounding guard. Marisa starts, stops, blows past Porter, extra pass to Camden, deep inside who lays it in the left block. Unselfish play by the roommates. Caden to Kane, Kane against Cash, and Cash with another block, her second straight, a long outlet to Shea Hagen. She's got Porter to beat, finger roll, it's good, turning defense into offense. It starts with an emphatic Cash block. A bounce pass to Amani Lewis to the free throw line, it's snatched away by Janasia Cash, long outlet from Camden to Beverly, who's able to sneak in the layup on the right side. Beautiful bullet pass from Camden to Beverly, 40 feet in the air and strike. Hand off to Marisa, crossover dribble down the right side, a kick to Beverly, bluffs in the three, a swivel across the lane to Anna Camden, who finger rolls that shot in. Janasia Cash, free throw line extended, takes a dribble, holds the ball high above her head, zips a strong pass to Beverly, jabbing, now she'll unload a three, that swirls in. Naya Beverly hits the tray and triple. Clockwise passing, and then a uh, swipe by Janasia Cash. Loose ball picked up in the near corner for Anna Camden. Here's McKenna Marisa across the midcourt stripe. A shovel across the lane to Janasia Cash, who's got 18 points. Berger finding Ghoul Bay from the corner. Berger and Ghoul Bay are roommates together. On the push, it's Penn State, and Cash getting up in town. Everyone for Indiana, boom, boom, boom. Three strong, quick, intentional steps. Burke could be the spark for this team because she's been so good from deep. Instead, yeah, Camden gets Camden the basket, their first points of this quarter. The Spartans bench has almost outscored Penn State, 22 to 23, but a turnover leads to an opportunity. Nice Let's feed go, from Cash to McKenna. The Lions have this half. Penn State in transition. Naya Beverly says, give me that. Cash says, there you go. So many coaches talk about finding that third scorer, and that is McKenna Warnock for Lisa Bluter, but a great hezzy move by Janesia Clark. And nothing going from deep so far, coming off a career high 39. That one rattles out. Rebound by Janesia Cash. She flips it to Camden. Great teamwork inside. State 11-0 boards from the Lady Lions as they continue creating second chance opportunities for themselves and keep the lead. There is no breathing room so far as this game has been tied already five times. Five different lead changes at the nice bounce pass to Cash. Make that six ties as Penn State comes right back and ties it up at 23. As Cash has the ball on the other end, tries to pass it out. Three-pointer no good. Penn State doing a good job now keeping the ball in their hands and passing it out as that shot is good. Penn State's got to get McKenna Marisa going. Wearing the headband, she drops it down low to John Asia Cash, and that's a tandem that has worked. Penn State averages over nine and a half three-pointers per team, but who needs three-pointers when you've got bullet passing like that to Nia Beverly? The unselfish play, great ball movement. Marisa threat the needle to Nia Beverly for the finish. Penn State getting it done on the offensive end. If her shot's not falling, she's going to find a way to impact the game, and that she has done again this afternoon. Well, they find Garcia again. She's got five crucial points here for Penn State. Anything they can do to try to fluster and speed up their opponent on offense. And it's Cash who gets the first touch in the lay-in for the first points for Penn State. And, and that's a little bit, here's Higgins, that's a little bit of the beauty of playing the same team in th after three days, and it's Naya Beverly who knocks down the three. An eight nothing start here for Penn State.
John Asia Cash. She's got four points here to start. Four of the first seven for Michigan State. John Asia Cash's first look in two. And initiate offense for Michigan State. Lost the handle. And here comes Penn State. Oh, wow. A touchdown pass and finish there for Shea Hagan. What a pass from Cash. Asia Cash, a 6-2 quarterback. Transition buckets created by good defense. Cash to Hagan. Thank you.